Hi, this is Yolanda Van Veen, and in this segment we're going to talk about staking hollyhocks. Now hollyhocks are such a beautiful plant. They can get 10 feet tall with lots of flowers that are just like paper roses and they're just beautiful, almost like a hibiscus too. They're just a pretty, pretty plant. But they do get tall. They can get 10 feet tall or longer and a lot of times they want to fall over when they get that tall. And so you should stake them that way that they you can protect them and you can enjoy them even longer. And an easy rule of thumb when you stake a flower, stake a plant, is make sure that the stake is half the size of the plant's height, allowing for two feet, up to two feet under the ground. So you either want to hammer it right into the ground or actually just um, dig a hole and place the stake into the ground. But as long as that stake is about two feet under the earth, it usually will support itself. And when you're tying up the hollyhock to the stake, you want to make sure and use a soft material. Never use wire or nothing that's going to be really damaging to the stem. So old nylons work really well. An old sheet cut up into pieces works really well. Anything made out of cotton, old clothes, old socks, anything that you can recycle is perfect for that reason. And you want to tie the side of the material to the stake pretty tight, but you want to tie it really loosely to the hollyhock because you want to give it some sway and you want to make sure that you're not damaging the stem. And by making sure that your hollyhock has enough sun, has enough air, and a lot of times you put it up to a side of a house or your shop so it has something to hold on to, then it will grow really well and it won't need staking. But when you stake it, it's really easy to do. Just make sure that you don't use wire and that you make sure that your stick is at least two, in, two feet into the ground. And that way you can enjoy your hollyhock through the fall.